perceive, reached out to Denny and asked him. I, I want people to understand, Denny O'Brien didn't come asking us to do this. We sought him out, and it was Josh Shapiro who did this. And Josh is obviously one of the brightest young members of the legislature, has a tremendous future. And uh, Josh, I thank you for, for your initiative and, and your persuasive powers as well. And lastly, I want to say a word about John Purcell. You know, much has been said and much has been written about John Purcell, and certainly in the last year, um, he did some things and said some things that created a lot of public ire. He made a mistake in the pay raise, but so did I. Um, if this is the end of John Purcell's career as speaker and perhaps his career in leadership, it should be noted that um, he has been an enormous help to advancing the goals of the people of Pennsylvania. When I became governor, he could have dug his heels in and taken a truly partisan approach and said, everything that this governor is going to initiate is going to fail. And he probably would have had the power to do that. But again, he put that type of politics aside <coughs> and operated in the good of the people of Pennsylvania. Understand, without John Purcell, we would not have had an economic stimulus plan. Without John Purcell, we would not have had the innovative education funding that we have now. Without John Purcell, we wouldn't have been able to do the things to protect our environment or to become a leader in renewable energy. Without John Purcell, we would not have had um, the uh, uh, minimum wage bill. John Purcell was an important part of making progress in each and every area. Without John Purcell, we wouldn't have had property tax relief, the very first important step on the road to property tax relief. So if, in fact, this is the end of John Purcell's role in leadership, uh, his scorecard should have a balance on it. There should be some minuses, but we should all be candid and admit that his leadership led us to a number of significant gains for the people of Pennsylvania. And with that, I'm happy to answer any questions or anybody up here uh, with me, uh, happy to answer any questions.